Hi, this is Editing Me and I just wanted to come in here real quick and explain some stuff. So people have asked me about my accent often, mostly on other platforms. Now they've never been mean, usually they just couldn't place it and they were curious. This is for the most part on purpose. For the longest time I have used a Russian accent, mixed with the German one. And now this has kind of morphed into just how I talk and I think it's fun, so I'm not going to force a change. So yeah, if you were ever curious about it, now you know and now we can get back to the video. Thanks. Sorry. I had completely forgotten to turn on my mic, but I have opened the package now and we can dive in. Now, first thing I ordered was a two pack of these markers by Sailor. Um, they are from the Four Seasons collection and I bought the uh, I think it's the spring and autumn uh, one I, I'm sure it uh, it says somewhere on there but I can't read Japanese so yeah you'll just have to look for yourself the colors are these I will link everything down below that I bought so you can find it and either buy yourself or know what I mean so you can um, search it somewhere else. Okay, the next pens I have are these. Um, I'm sure you have seen them already. They are not that new. Uh, this Rosa Clip 0 0.5 in the Vintage Colors um, selection, collection, whatever. Um, yeah, it's, it's nothing, nothing fancy, just a few of uh, colored uh, gel pens. Now this one. I am excited about it's uh, the Travelers Notebooks or Travelers Company Notebooks B-Sides and Rarities the sticker release paper insert. I did order some stickers so I, I am hoping that I don't have a sticker album or something so this will be my only one and I can just take it with me uh, and with my Hobonichi wigs. So yeah. Next thing is this Midori um, clip ruler, I guess you could say. Um, I do have Midori tab, like index tab clips in my planner. This one I thought um, is nice and I don't have to find a ruler and it has like stencils on it. Can I just... oh god, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, so maybe just this way. There's uh, a few cute stencils and a ruler and it's very thin you just clip it inside the the uh, notebook or whatever and yeah now these um this is a, a k create um kakria <laughs> kakria I don't know. Anyway, this is the the brand. Uh, Plus is also the brand, I think. I 
those are just a gridded notebooks with a nice paper it's the premium version and i also bought a um like a clear cover for it now i myself have these two of these in black plus a um pvc or like a fake leather cover and these i bought um for my husband just just a notebook and a cover so he can take it with him this obviously <laughs> is uh my hobonichi weeks mega in this sunny blue um version that i will be using oh god it's magnetic <laughs> sorry i will be using next year maybe even start in december it's i'm certain you have seen this before it's like just the months and the weeks and the the pocket that comes with it and stuff it's nothing it's it's nothing new or fancy and i will be just using it with a clear cover um and a um midori uh notebook seal it, it's called belt seal but i'm not not certain what that is uh, it's just you stick it on the back side of your uh, notebook or cover and you can uh, put the a little magnetic thing on this side and uh, this way you can just close it and there's also a pen loop so yeah i'm uh, yeah very simple i'm not uh, going to get a leather cover or anything um since i i would like one obviously because i love leather colors uh covers but i'm not uh if you have seen my uh previous video or like my naughty video i'm not certain yet i will be using this for the whole year because i don't know if i um will be able to deal with the horizontal layout of the wigs and if i don't i will go back to my nolte which already has a cover so i won't be needing one for this but if i like it and i um going to use it through the year and um maybe even next year then i will probably buy myself a a leather cover or like a wallet cover so i can combine my planner and my wallet in one now this is just um i think it's this year's uh like pencil board that you can just uh use under the pages or as a page marker so because the paper is very thin and if you don't want to like write on two pages you you will have to like put the pencil board underneath yeah that's that's it now accessories i also got this um pen it's a uh, mitsubishi pen and um the fun thing is it's a uh three colored pen red blue and black obviously you change it when you like twist it here basically uh, you change the color first you obviously have to close it and then you can write with them now i chose it because it was a three color pen which is um convenient and it's not as thick as most of them because i did not know if it would otherwise fit into this uh seal thing and also a uh, nice thing about this pen is it's erasable it's uh 
and the eraser is integrated in the uh, pen so yeah and i mean i i i'm aware that i could uh, buy just a friction a pilot friction i think they're called uh which is also erasable but i i hate the design of them like this with the with the tribal stuff on it and like i i know there are fancy versions of a, a pilot friction where i could just get myself another pen and just use the um the um the the pen refill but those usually don't have the eraser integrated and um also, the ones by Friction themselves, the fancy ones that look nice, they are way too expensive for me. Or at least the ones I found were too expensive. So I got this one and it was just like, I don't know, three bucks or something. Now, um, another thing I got was a two-pack of these. Oh my God. Can I just um correction tapes and they are cream colored ones so I'm hoping they will be nice for the Hobonichi weeks I could just let me just test it okay I'm done so yeah the Hobonichi weeks as you can see has very cream colored um pages and this is where I used this like correction tape, also very cream colored, and you can barely see it. If I use the white one, you could definitely see it. But this one is nice, and I'm glad that I found a shade that works well for this. Okay, what else? I have bought a new ink. <laughs> I'm yes, I like fountain pens. I like inks. Uh, I can't uh, show you my fountain pens or better yet my inks currently because they are still packed away in a where we have our stuff and I'm still in the uh, hotel situation anyway. So yeah, I got this ink by Sailor Shikiori ink. It's in the color i forgot i cannot read it i will do <laughs> it in, in the video so you know which um color and name it is it's like a dark green like my nails a bit so yeah it's it's a nice ink uh, i i already have a another shade of this the um reddish bluish dark uh, Yamadori ink color it's called by Sailor also and I love it and so I thought why wouldn't I love this one so yeah another shade another ink I'm very happy <laughs> and the last thing this is very interesting I actually bought a few sheets of stickers but this is what I got. It's like a box with, I'm assuming, the stickers. Very interesting. Let me just... Oh! Oh, okay. Yeah. If you... <clears throat> if you follow the link that I... um posted about what I actually bought this is not it I mean they are cut and they are stickers but they are I I don't know if maybe I just didn't understand but they look like like big big sheets of stickers and not like these little I mean, they are nice. They look like nice um, uh, washi stickers. But 
I wasn't I was not expecting them to come in this um type of packaging and way so yeah interesting I mean I'm not mad at it it's it's nice but I did not expect it well anyway so the la well the last thing I uh, ordered from Amazon is this uh, it came separately because they didn't have it in stock. It is... Oh god, let me just... Ooh! That's a... Oh, nice. There is a... Okay, this is a five-year journal by Midori. And it's... I don't know if I can... Should I just... Mm. Yes. Let me just take it out of here. Take this off. It's a linen uh, cloth embroidered uh, channel, and it's it's smaller than a. See, this is a Hobonichi weeks. It's a little wider, but about the same height. So yeah, it's it's smaller than a five, um, but bigger than a six. So it's undated, or rather, it is dated, but uh, the years are undated. So I could start this in 2022 and skip it in 23 and instead use it in 24, 25, 26, 27, or 28. It doesn't matter. You can write the year uh, yourself. The uh, days are dated. Um, so... For the five years, you have like the 19th of April and uh, what you did each year. It's just a few lines, which I think is very doable for something that you have to do every day. And it's exceptionally pretty. Um, the, the months are also like they have like little embroidered looking tabs, but they're not. They're just printed on. But it's very pretty and I I love the cover. I just I was and it comes with a clean cover also, like a cover on cover to protect it, which I like it. Uh, it, it does not have a pen loop, but I like the clear cover to protect the cloth. Um I was deciding between um this one. And the Hobonichi five year journal. I wanted a five year journal for like since 2019 or so, uh, or a three year journal. Uh, but I didn't know which one to pick. Uh, however, Hobonichi, I think, has like has them every year. But this one, this cover. I don't know if it uh, would have been available in like two years or, or even five if I used the other one first. So I did not want to miss out on this cover. So I bought this one instead. Um, now I know that I will probably be out of luck with the Hobonichis in the next years if I ever decide to buy one because... Um, as I have um, found out, the uh, Tomo River paper is not manufactured anymore, or they stopped uh, to manufacture it in December 2020, as far as it looks now, because um, wood pulp was just too expensive, which I am... I'm not surprised because a wood for building and stuff, I even found out myself, is basically non-existent or very, very expensive. So, yeah, I, I'm not surprised they are having difficulties and uh, stop the production of the paper. They might start again, but we, we don't know. And any type of uh, Tomer River paper that is currently available in little shops, big shops, from Hobonichi themselves, is just rest stock that is being so. 
yeah, that is being sold off. So if you want to stock up on it, maybe this would be now the time because, yeah, it's not being produced anymore. Um, I still have one um, notebook insert with Tomoe River paper and obviously now my uh, Tomoe River uh, planner. And I might buy another one. I might look for other papers. I've already uh, ordered some little, just little notebooks with a different paper that might be nice for me um i do like the midori paper so i already know that this one is nice i also like this um okay uh, kakria plus kakria paper it's it's nice uh i've as far as i'm aware i've tried it with uh, some fountain pens uh, in mind like the ones that i bought like last year and the uh, it was fine for fountain pen, I think. Now, this concludes everything I have ordered on Amazon Japan, but I do have uh, a few, like three other things that I have bought for myself for the 2022 planner season, but I did not buy it from a shop. I, well, <laughs> obviously yes i did buy it from a shop but not like um but not um like the amazon shop more uh, i i just saw those things in like little shops w when i was shopping and uh bought them now the first thing i found very nice is the this washi it's uh, 10 rows with uh, getting smaller and they are like autumn, winter themed and I thought it was a very nice find. I don't have a lot of washi. I have like 20 rolls <laughs> and um, that's it. And now I have 30 uh, but all my washi is um, packaged away in boxes. So this is all I have with me currently. Then I also bought, <laughs> this is stupid. Um, I also bought like little uh, composition notebooks for children, like sc starting school, blah, whatever. I, I don't use those notebooks. I will give them to my spouse and he can just use it as notebook paper next to his computer. I, why I bought them is this um, blotting paper because there's in those composition notebooks for children is always one sheet of blotting paper and I thought I could just um, cut it to size and use it in my planner. Uh, so I bought two of these. I, I do have other blotting paper in my uh, journal but it's used like I've used it all year so I needed new ones and I couldn't find a notebook just made of blotting paper I know those exist but I it, I this is what I saw so I bought it so yeah it's just yeah it costs like 35 cents now the other thing that I bought is, is this uh, set of sticky notes they are just cute little sticky notes because I, I actually don't have any anymore. I had some neon colored ones in my boxes but I wanted some that are a bit more muted and pastel like and I just saw this in a like a one dollar bin or something and I got it so why not. Okay so this is pretty much everything that I bought for next year and um, I like it all of it actually I will still have to try out this pen because I have no idea how it writes but I'm glad that I found the cream uh, correction tape and this ink and um, this fun little uh, pen loop notebook holder whatever you want to call it 
I'm sorry. <laughs> and those those pens, I already know how to write because I've seen a lot of videos. Um, yeah. So that's my haul. I hope I hope you liked it and it was somewhat interesting for you. And um, yeah, I will think about what else I want to make a video of. Probably setting up my Hobonichi weeks, like later this year. Uh, otherwise, uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!